An update on the possible Richarlison deal. Spurs and Everton are in talks and they are also discussing a possible deal where Harry Wintz will go to Goodison Park. Gleason Bramer will decide on his future club next week after his holiday and reports are stating it will be either Spurs or Inter Milan. A Spurs midfielder has just signed his first professional contract with the club and a former Spurs star and Champions League winner has just signed for a club in the MLS. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you're all keeping well. This is another edition of Tottenham News where I'll be going through all of the latest Spurs news, rumours and reports. If you're watching this on YouTube, please do hit that subscribe button and also like and share. If you're listening to this on an audio platform, do hit that follow button and leave a review if you can. And please do check out the channel sponsors, One Football, Zooch Converters, William Hill and Live Football on TV. Now, an update has just been provided by transfer expert and Italian journalist Brizio Romano on the Richarlison situation. He has stated that Tottenham are still well informed on Richarlison, was discussed during talks for Harry Winks to Everton. Richarlison would be open to a Spurs move. It also depends on Rafinha Domino. Harry Winks' talks ongoing are slow, um, as he could be included in the Richarlison talks or separated deal. It has also been confirmed today by The Athletic that Richarlison is Antonio Conte's and Tottenham Hotspur's first choice target. Reports have just been published in Italy and they are stating that Tottenham Hotspur and Inter Milan are currently leading the race for Torino defender Gleison Bremer. And the reports are stating that the defender likes both clubs. The reports also state that the Torino star is currently on holiday in Brazil at the moment, but when he returns from holiday, Bremer hopes to agree on a contract with a new club as soon as possible. An official statement has just been released by Tottenham Hotspur Football Club stating we are delighted to announce that Rio Kayamatan has signed his first professional contract with the club. The midfielder who turned 17 earlier this month has been with us since the age of eight and is about to begin his second season as a full-time player. An England under-17 international, Rio made 27 appearances in all competitions for our under-18s last term, scoring seven goals while also stepping into feature once for our development squad in Premier League 2. Now, for any of you that wanted Gareth Bale back for a third spell at Tottenham Hotspur, it's not happening because Fabrizio Romano has just confirmed that Gareth Bale has just joined Los Angeles Football Club on a free transfer. Here we go. Uh, confirmed. Gareth Bale leaves European football to try new MLS experience. Agreement has been put in place. And lastly, a report has just been published by the Daily Mail and they are stating that Ryan Mason and Rachel Peters tied the knot in a stunning wedding ceremony attended by Tottenham Hotspur striker Harry Kane on Friday in Mallorca. The former Spurs player and interim coach could not contain his smile as he said I do to his incredible bride who wowed in a strapless lace gown. Now, my thoughts on these stories in this episode, let's start with the Richarlison one. Um, I've said many, many times on this channel, I like Richarlison. I think he's a versatile forward. He can play on either side, the left, the right. He can play in the middle, very versatile, uh, can score goals, can finish, can assist. I would like to see him in a Spurs shirt. And, uh, you know, from what we understand and all of these reports being published right now, he is Antonio Conte's number one target. So I wouldn't be at all surprised to see Spurs get this deal over the line in the near future. Um, you know, particularly after the £100 million now becoming available and uh, Spurs are ready to spend. And of course, when you put in Harry Winks as well, um, you know, why can't a deal be done? A very simple deal. You have Harry Winks, we have Richarlison and we just give you some money as well. I'd be very surprised if uh, Gleason Bremer become a Tottenham Hotspur player. You know, many reports have stated that 
Um, his agent had had an agreement with Inter Milan. It's just a matter now of Inter Milan and Torino getting that deal done. So I'd be surprised if he uh, if he came to Spurs. Uh, something drastic would have to happen there, I think, if he was to become a Spurs player. Um, Gareth Bale now going to the MLS. I'm not at all surprised. Wish him all of the very best. Uh, of course, he's had a fantastic career at the likes of Tottenham and Real Madrid. Of course, all of those trophies he has won at Real Madrid. So wish him all of the very best in the MLS. And of course, uh, he'll be playing in the World Cup for Wales at the end of the year. Now, thanks for watching and thanks for listening. If you're watching this on YouTube, please do hit that subscribe button. Also, like and share. And if you're listening to this on an audio platform, please do hit that follow button and leave a review if you can. And also, please do check out the channel sponsors, One Football, Zooch Converters, William Hill and Live Football on TV. Enjoy the rest of your day and I'll see you on the next one. Until then, come on you Spurs.